Hello! Welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. So here we are, underneath this uh, beautiful overpass, on our way to... Where were we going? Alright, we were going to go... No, I don't want to set my marker. We're going to go visit whatever this place is, so that we can sort of preempt Caesar wanting us to make him allies around the wasteland. Because to get to Caesar, we're going to have to go all the way down here. So this one's practically on the way. So this is like the, I don't know, the Great Khans or something. And we're just going to go and do our missions for them. Get it over with and save some time so that Caesar will think we're great. Oh my god, what are you? What the hell is that? Oh, it's something that doesn't like me anyway. Um, should I shoot it? Oh, it's one of those big horn things. Hang on. Have I got... I have got some sniper ammo. Why am I using that gun then? There we go. That'll teach you to give me the stink eye. Yep. Jumped up cow. Um... <laughs> I mean, oh look, I leveled up and everything. That, that was the best act of random violence I've ever committed, I think. Um, and there has been quite a few. Right, what skills do I need? I like having sneak. A, a little bit of sneak. Um, God, my repair. I need a bit of repair. I probably need more speech as well. I'm going to take this level to give myself some speech. And then I can have five more points and let's put them in explosives. And, okay, I get something new. Light touch. Customize light armor for maximum benefit. Uh, no, I don't think I'm a light touch. Rapid reload retention. No. Bloody mess. What I want, demolition expert. Oh. I don't know, I'd like something useful. Sniper. The chance to hit an opponent's head in vats is significantly increased. That's what I need. Or adamantium skeleton. Oh, limbs receive less damage. I do damage my limbs a lot. Oh, which do we want? Let's go for sniper now. And we'll we'll get adamantium skeleton later on. Because um, it's better to be able to, like, decapitate your foe before they attack. Than, um, you know, to have to... Oh, I'm still sneaking. Then to have to, you know, um, resist damage from them. Do these cows hate me? No. That is a relief. It was just those particular cows that don't like me. They're, these ones are fine. Is this the underpass that the um, gun runners live under? Was it this one up ahead? It was around here anyway. I'll we'll have to keep an eye out for them, those young rapscallions. See if I can buy some ammun ammunition from them. I don't know if I have much money anymore. Um, I haven't really been keeping track, and I'm going off course from where I want to be. If they're not under this one, and it doesn't look like they are, let's see. What way do I go? I'll just go this way. Oh, I've been playing through uh, Spore for like the 50 billionth time. Um, I love that game. I really wish they'd make a sequel to that. Um, I just love making creatures. I know there's um, some fan game, a fan sequel in the works. It's on Steam. Um, I think there's a demo available. God. Oh. Hello. Are you friendly? How may I serve you, master? Okay, master. I like that. Um, yeah, there's some um, fan game. I think it's called Elysian Eclipse. And it's like... It's basically like a Spore fan remake um, in the works. Although, I don't know. It seems very early stages. I'm a little, I'm a little skeptical of it. Um from what they've shown so far. It seems a bit too good to be true. But surely we must... It, 
we must be near the time when someone is going to suggest an official Spore sequel. Like, everyone wants it. Well, I want it. When are they going to give it to me? Anyway, where am I going? Oh, look. Is this a door into the mountain? Is this where I'm meant to go? A ranger safe house. Oh, I don't have a key. That's a shame. Could have gone in and robbed all their stuff. What is this goal? Oh, that's the one I'm going for. Okay, I've been following the wrong one. <laughs> Great. Okay, so I'm going for this one. I thought I was going for this one, which is probably like up those mountains. Back in that mutant village. Where I said I'd help them solve their problems, but then my dog died, so I vowed never to return. <laughs> yeah, that place. Uh oh. Am I um going the right Oh crap, I'm in danger. I'm in danger. Something knows I'm here and I see death claws. Um Oh shit. Oh crap. Oh they're coming right for me. Oh my god, this is the end. This is the end. Um, oh. oh god. When did I quick save? I think... I think I quick saved far too recently. No, I'm still hidden. Okay. That's fine. Phew. Okay, well, we won't be going that way. <laughs> oh my god, how did that happen? There are death claws everywhere, it seems. I don't have the kind of firepower I need for that. I need like a big feckin minigun or something. Ironically, they're called miniguns, even though they're actually quite large. But I need one of them. Those? Was that thunder? I didn't know there was thunder in this game. Um, I'm moving very, very quickly suddenly. Ever since that reload. I don't know what has changed. Um, maybe I'm a ghost now. The death claw thing was my actual death. And this is all, you know, the afterlife. Now. Oh, it's radioactive up here. Great. Um, have I, do I have a bit of rad away? Or rad -X? Maybe both? Oh, I have both. Take some rad -X. I'll take two rad -X and a rad away. And that should hopefully, um... Holy crap! What the hell are you? Okay, need a shorter range weapon. Oh! Two of you now. Okay. Well. I see. So that's how it's going to be. <clears throat> Is this some sort of super mutant town? Like bad super mutants? Oh, come on. That's, that's not what I came here for. Do I, it's not even near where I need to go. I can, maybe I can go around it. 
Um, hello? Okay, it doesn't... Okay, there doesn't seem to be more of them. I think... I think I might be safe. I think everything's good. Except for the slow radiation poisoning. <laughs> um, oh, crap. That's one over there, isn't it? Moving around. Yeah, there's two of them. Where's my where's my sniper rifle? I wonder. They're quite far away. Oh god, there's three. And then that one has a gigantic gun. I think that is a mini gun, like I was talking about. See, it's not very miniature. Maybe it's called a mini gun because it's the same weight as like a mi a mini, like the car. Oh my god, what are those noises? Terrible things happening. There's some sort of enemies over there. I think... I... Oh god. I have somehow stumbled into the top level of some sort of super mutant dungeon and I'm now trying to find my way out of it. Which is um, unusual to say the least. It's an uncomfortable situation. Can I get him? I'd like to have his gun, actually. Let's see what I can do with this perk. Only 10%. No. Oh, there's two of them there. Oh, no. He's a super mutant master. They're pretty tough. And, oh, there's three of them. I'd like the gun, though. Oh, it's an incinerator. It's a flamethrower. Oh, I'm, not, I'm not as bothered now. He's not going to have the kind of ammo I want. It's fine. Neil's shack. Is that... Which bit is Neil's shack? The whole mountain? Maybe it started out as a shack. Oh, God. Oh, wait. Oh, is this Neil? This Neil? is a dangerous place, human, especially for your kind. I suggest you turn back. There's nothing good waiting for you further on. Sure, you seem pretty friendly. Keep saying things like that and I won't be so friendly. Not every super mutant is a brain damaged brute. Many of us are just as intelligent as basic humans, and the rest don't really have any choice in the matter, do they? Oh, sorry, no offense intended. And none taken, since you apologize. See ya, Goodbye. Neil. I presume I'm meant to approach from this side, which is when he would give me that speech, but, um... Oh, that's good. He seems like an okay guy. I wonder should I kill him? See if he's carrying any of those, uh, star, star bottle caps. If there's anything I've learned in the Wasteland, it's to kill all the nice people, because they all collect bottle caps. Um... Right... So I should be safe enough out here, I think. Oh. Epic slow motion. Okay. Oh. Are these more scorpions, or are these... Oh, look, there's a fence here. That has to be... These have to be the guys I'm after. Look at that one. He's got a bit of a strange walk on him.
Ooh. That one got a little too close. But I think I killed them all. Was that a trap to keep me out? Discovered the hidden valley. Oh, isn't this where, like, Littlefoot and all the dinosaurs went? Maybe that guy, the one from Novak, that's, um, that's Sharptooth. Sharptooth from the, the Land Before Time. The, um, evil villain. Aha. Uh -huh. Some sort of... Oh, here we go. Here is an entrance. My dad's cousin worked on the Land Before Time. I think he was an animator or something. Um, which I always think is pretty cool. It's a shelter. Joanne was here. Class of 99 rules. Make love, not war. This isn't where my thing is pointing me, though. My thing is pointing me over here. Aha. See, I'm being clever. Perhaps this bunker is a trap. Perhaps the real entrance is over this way. Or maybe this is this is just directing me to the, like the official entrance to the hidden valley and then I don't know the bunker is something else entirely. The bunker is the real way in and I am being misled. Oh, because there's another entrance there. I can see why this valley has been so hidden with this many scorpions running around in it. Who would want to come here? 